a very good morning to all of you we all know that seed is a tiny part of a plant which gives rise to a new plant a plant produces many seeds but not all grow into new plants so let's learn about seed dispersal a plant is a living thing that can make its own food from water and carbon dioxide in the presence of sunlight the flower in a plant becomes the fruit after pollination and fertilization the fruits have seeds inside which germinate into new plants seed dispersal when all seeds from the plant fall at one place they do not get proper conditions to grow as the area is crowded so scattering of seeds is required so that they get proper conditions to grow seed dispersal is the movement or transport of seeds away from the parent plant the agents of dispersal are wind water animals explosion and human beings seeds dispersed by wind seeds from plants like dandelions and cottonwood trees are light and have feathery bristles and can be carried long distances by by the wind some plants like maple trees have winged seeds they don't float away but but flutter to the ground the seeds of madar have hair which allow them to be carried away easily by wind to far off places where they fall and germinate seeds dispersed by water many aquatic plants and plants that live near water have seeds that can float and are carried by water plants living along streams and rivers have seeds that float and germinate at new places the size of the seed is not a factor in determining whether or not a seed can float some seeds are very large like coconuts but they can also float seeds dispersed by animals animals disperse seeds in several ways first some plants like sainbur have barbs or other structures that can get tangled in animal fur or feathers and are then carried far away to germinate other plants like mango produce their seeds inside fleshy fruits that then get eaten by an animal the fruit is digested by the animal but the seeds pass through the digestive tract and are dropped in other locations where they germinate seeds dispersed by explosion some plants have unique ways to disperse their seeds in plants like pea balsam and witch hazel when the fruit becomes ripe it bursts open or explodes and the seeds shoot out the seeds can travel quite a few feet away from the mother plant fall and germinate when they get favorable conditions seed dispersed by human beings humans eat various fruits and vegetables and throw their seeds after eating when these seeds get adequate conditions for germination they grow to become plants in this way humans help in seed dispersal after the seeds are dispersed to far off places away from the mother plant they germinate into new plants when they find suitable conditions 
air, water and warmth to grow. This cycle of a seed growing to a new plant, the plant producing flowers, fruits and seeds, the seeds being scattered and germinating into new plants continues. This cycle goes on and on. Thank you. Have a wonderful day.